I'm broke and they sometimes going to quit my job. That's crazy, man. It For that anyway, welcome, welcome back to my YouTube channel once again. If you are new here, hey, my name is Gina. This channel I create content about my life as a housemaid in Safa Arab. Yeah. Okay, so if you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe, okay, and click that notification button on so that anytime I upload a new video, you'll be the first person to see the video, okay? Hey. My returning subscribers, thank you so much for always being there for me. Very soon, I'll be in Ghana and very soon, I need to be monetized because I'm going to quit my job. I'm going to stop doing my husband's job work, okay? For the past four years, that's what I do for a living and I'm going to stop and I'm broke. <laughs> you know, it's very funny. It may sound funny for you, okay? Because <laughs> I'm broke. And they sometimes going to quit my job. That's crazy, man. It may sound crazy for you, but hey, it's about time I need to put things together. Let's forget that, okay? So very soon I'll be going to Ghana, and now it has left me um 230 for watch hours for me to hit my 4,000 watch hours. Guys, please share my video, okay? Share my video and take me to 4,000 watch hours, okay? So that when I get to Ghana, it will not take me very long for me to monetize. Or if I get to Ghana, as soon as I get home, I'll be monetizing my channel. At least YouTube can give me some small, small coins that I can use to, you know, do one or two things so that I can come out again look for a different work or start a different business or start everything again so please share my video and support me and i'm praying that when i get home things will be okay for me because i'm going to change my location and you know youtube is the whole things together it's sometimes crazy so guys take me to my 4000 watch hours okay by sharing my video so without wasting much time okay let me get straight into the video now it seems like i feel so happy although youtube haven't started paying me but i feel so comfortable and happy now if i'm sitting like if i'm sitting me tell what kind me record the video and now me won't come like now it's it's pushed me to go and record video because it's like because of youtube i have met a lot of people i have met different people all together like like who am i i'm so grateful and i thank god that at that time i got that idea that i should start a youtube channel i should i should start a youtube channel and i was having a lot of stories to share for the stories there if i said i want to share stories about my life charlie people may think that i talk much but hey i don't talk much i don't brag but I'm a living testimony because if I tell you where I have been, the bullying, everything for the past some years ago, and if I look at where I am now, I don't have money, I don't have anything, but hey, I'm comfortable. I'm only, I'm really, really comfortable at with what God has made me because that was my mind that I always, whenever I I face any problem at that time i told myself hey me i'll be a millionaire that's why i'm suffering that was my word i haven't got money i don't have anything but hey i'm comfortable at where i am <laughs> so let's start the video okay so today my advice is that most people think that they are boss this advice goes to the arabs madams you are boss whatever you find yourself as a boss okay Make sure you respect people under you. Make sure you respect your employers. Make sure if you are a supervisor, whatever you find yourself that you, someone is working for you, make sure you respect the person because you don't know how the future looks like. Today, I may be a house help. My mother may look down on me. Her kids may look down on me. But maybe they may never knew how much future looks like. Because I'm a big girl here. I'm a very, very rich girl. Maybe people don't know, but trust me, you can mark it on the wall or wherever you are watching me. That give me another 10 years. Maybe I will not give myself a small time 
so that if I couldn't get there, yeah, people will miss it. Even if I get there and I couldn't get I knew, I knew I would achieve it. Okay. So, you don't know how my future looks like. So, don't look down on me. Don't think I'm a trash. Don't think I clean your toilet. I clean, you know, everything. So, you may think I'm not that much important. Trust me. You are, you are not the one holding my future. I have a very beautiful and, and a bright future. Although, I'm not that much educated. But I, got, I have got to realize that it's not only education that can make you who you are in life. Okay? It's just applying and your mindset and hard working. That will get you to a level in your life. So, forget, forget about it. Education, bad English. I'll give you bad English, sir. Because that's what I have. <laughs> so I'm I'm even lost in I'm I'm even lost hey bro for bunny party I'm even I'm lost but let me get to track okay so if someone is working for you please respect the person okay if if you were a boss make sure that the person under you you may respect the person because i'm your i'm i'm working for you that's why you were a boss without me you are not a boss okay without me you cannot get that title now that, that you are going around i'm a boss i'm a manager i'm this, this without your employer you are nothing Okay, so if someone is working for you, someone is under you, make sure you treat the person very well because this world we are living in, it's a very crazy world and God always changed people's life mysteriously. You know, that person may meet someone and that person, just a day, that person's life may change. And maybe the person will stop doing boy boy for you or the person will stop doing house help for you. Okay, and go and be his own boss or something. So if someone is working for you, make sure the table can turn. Okay, so respect the person. Don't look down on the person working for you because at the end of the day, my working, I'm working for you and you get something to eat. So that means I'm supporting you. You are also supporting me. We are supporting each other. Okay, so if, if you were a boss here, make sure you respect your employees because without me maybe you may be nothing okay so let's respect papers under us so that at the end of the day we win together we don't know how the future looks like we don't know what the future holds for it may happen that something may happen you may lost your your boss title something may happen you can lose that opportunity you have got as a boss okay and the one under you may come and take your position and look at maybe you you treated the person very bad. Look at the way maybe a person may also treat you. Maybe the person may have a good heart like me <laughs> to treat you nice. But deep inside you, you'll be judging yourself because of how you treated the person at the position she was at some times ago. Okay, so if you are boss here, please, my advice is let us respect people around us. Let us respect people in in our office, people we are working for. Let's respect them so that at the end of the day we win together. Because God has created this beautiful beautiful world with beautiful people. Why don't we stay in together? Why do we have to always look down on people because of their job? Why do we have to always talk to people anyhow? Because you were boss. Remember in Shebre and in Castle. Okay. Remember as every day time keeps on changing and every day things keep on happening. So today, that's my advice, okay? And if you were house help here, or if you are working for someone and the person is treating you very bad, remember that's what you do for a living, okay? So make don't make any decision or don't talk to your boss too anyhow because he's treating you anyhow or he's talking to you anyhow. Make sure you always pray and work hard and there's more small money that your boss is paying you saves more small okay so that at the end of the day you can start your own business or start your own something so that you stop working for the person because you also need your peace of mind and you can't be under someone for the rest of your life you you also need to start your own thing so that you be your own boss okay so if you are working for someone make sure you humble yourself no matter the situation remember no condition is permanent no situation is permanent 
by all means that day will surely come that you also be your own boss you also be your own like do whatever you want for yourself and nobody can come and talk to you anyhow okay so this will be the end of the video please take me to 4,000 watch hours okay because that 4,000 watch hours I, I i want to get it before i get home so that when i get home man, hey chale i'm going to monetize my channel like who am i <laughs> you know just six months i took my channel very serious it's up to six months october october november december january february march okay exactly six months now and god has been so faithful to me and my lovely subscribers thank you so much okay if you are new here don't forget to join the j gang okay I'm, i'll always be your favorite georgina i'll always be on your screen so subscribe and support me so that i can also get something small small too it's as soon as because i'm coming to quit my job i'm coming to stop doing this job. okay so until i meet you in my next video always remember no condition is permanent bye for now